Hey guys, Robovac here, here with the Halo 4 product review. This week we are reviewing the Halo 4 Watcher, the Promethean Watcher, the watcher with the teeny weeny little legs and all that fun stuff on it. So look, here he is. He's pretty cool, doesn't have that many points of articulation, though that is not really a concern at the moment because he looks awesome. I mean, look at this guy. It's just a really good figure. It's highly detailed. Um, it includes a little base that you can mount him on so that, you know, everything works out and he can just sit there. But he also has this weird little plastic piece that acts like a, acts like a, acts like, oh my gosh, knife time. He has a little piece on him that uh, you can pop out and it basically acts as a little stand if you don't want to use the stand that it includes. So you could have him like this and it looks, it's kind of flimsy. It works, I guess, if you have these legs a little more forward and such. Honestly, I don't know why you would want it like that. It kind of makes it look weird. But yeah, so pretty cool figure. It uh, nine points of articulation, as I said before. The articulation points include the little fins here. These guys, they move. The little feet, the little baby feet, little little wingy things, which are connected to the joints with his legs. He can be like a tap dancer. Um, his torso moves a little bit, not very much though. And these two fins back here that would normally be with the if the the disc were out over here and on each side it it these two little fins up here would actually be down there but hey it's up here so it looks pretty cool um, yeah ac they've actually man made this spe spe specifically so that it would be able to fit in the uh, when they produce it into the uh, Promethean Knight's carapace which is a very cool idea. I love how McFarland Toys always makes things that to scale with each other. It's admirable. I guess I, I meant admirable when I said I'm, I'm, I admire it. So yeah, so um, pretty cool figure. The disc do, is removable, but it's don't really see why you would. Here, there we go. See, disc separate. They don't split in half. I was a bit disappointed about that, but honestly, how could they make that happen? Especially since they float out to either side of it when it's, you know, deployed and doing its little thing where it flings grenades back at you and makes your life miserable. But yeah, so it's a pretty cool figure. I highly recommend it. Um, yeah, it's amazing. So, yeah, there's, it's a pretty short review. This guy doesn't have all that much movement stuff on him, but he's cool. Very, very cool figure. I will be doing a review of all the figures from the second wave of of the series 1 figures including the the crawler cortana the uh, spartan and the the various spartan soldier figures and if they reveal it in time i will show you the guys the the promethean knight they they have leaked images of it well not really leaked it there's they're on forums and stuff it looks really big and awesome and terrifying and commander of the battlefield esque so yeah thank you guys for watching this has been robovacero reviewing the promethean watcher which is amazing and I highly recommend it. It retail price is what was it, thirteen ninety nine. I bought this one at GameStop, which is why it's in this uh, very thin blister package. It's the reason it's like that, and they're not in um, other retailers like Target. Isn't because it's like an exclusive thing. It's just because, for the purposes of GameStop, they needed to make the package smaller so they could store it in the store, store it in the store, store, store. So yeah, it's pretty cool. This has been Robovac here. Thank you guys for watching. This has been a Halo Four product review. I will have more eventually. I emphasize the eventually part. And um, yeah, so tomorrow Halo 4 comes out and I will be covering lots and lots of stuff. I'll probably have a video or two up for the uh, midnight release at the GameStop and the Microsoft Store in Austin, Texas. So thank you guys for watching. Again, this has been Robovacaro. Please like or favor this video if you found the review informative and helpful. And uh, subscribe for more Halo 4 stuff, more Halo gameplay, and um, product reviews eventually. So thank you guys for watching. Adiós.